take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. One answer. Stefan V oxygen needs two more electrons to fill its outermost shell. As you can see, oxygen has two of its eight electrons in the shell closest to the nucleus, and the remaining six electrons, which are called valence electrons, in its second shell. This is oxygen's outermost shell. Let's help you make your mark. As you go farther from the nucleus, electrons at higher energy levels have more energy. The maximum number of electrons at a given energy level depends on its number of orbitals. There are at most two electrons per orbital. Electrons in the outermost energy level of an atom are called valence electrons. Take our lead. If its valence electrons are less than 4, then valency is equal to number of valence electrons and if it is more than 4 then valency is obtained by subtracting number of valence electrons from 8. Atomic number of oxygen is 8. So, electronic configuration of oxygen equals 2, 6. Make your mark, take our lead. Carbon has 6 electrons, 2 in the first shell, and 4 in the second shell, so 4 valence electrons. Nitrogen has 7 electrons, 2 in the first shell, and 5 in the second shell, so 5 valence electrons. Oxygen has 8 electrons, 2 in the first shell, and 6 in the second shell, so 6 valence electrons. Thank you for watching, please subscribe and hit the bell notification.